Hello and welcome to Steamworld Archive Volume 31, which highlights Richard Greenwood's trips to the southern region in the early 1960s. Meanwhile, another merchant navy, Clan Line, speeds past with the down Bournemouth Express, the uniform rake of southern green coaching stock being typical for this era. In a few moments we'll catch another glimpse of Aberdeen Commonwealth as it sets off for its next station stop at Woking. The B4s were designed specifically for working the sharply curved tracks of Southampton docks, although they also carried out some station pilot duties in the Southampton area and shed pilot at Guildford. With the B4 safely off the main line and stabled in the sidings, Woolacombe arrives on a down express. 832 departs for the west, the station pilot, Pannier Tank 3720, is coupled up to the rear of the train that Tangmi has brought in, ready to detach a rake of vans. Back on the mostly double-track route from Evercreech Junction to Bath Green Park, 73050 rolls over the viaduct at Shepton Mallet and into the station. The small country town of Shepton Mallet was also served by the Great Western, but there was no physical connection between the two lines. The station is still intact but the goods yard is ominously empty. A healthy number of passengers alight before the gun. Safety valves lift as 31639 makes a spirited departure to tackle Pink's Hill Bank. The sign with six and eight indicates the stopping point for electric units at time. The class U's would remain in use on many Reading trains until diesel units took over in 1965. Another class H, 31263, leaves three bridges with a train for Tunbridge Wells via East Grinstead. This cross-country route had survived a closure threat in the 1950s, but didn't benefit from new rolling stock, and elderly push-pull formations would soldier on until 1965. Leaking piston rods make for a steamy departure as the train continues its journey to Rowfound and Three Bridges. Despite the scarcity of passengers, Grange Road was still a staffed station at this time. However, the station goods yard had closed in 1961, two Class years with 31863. Class A1X Terrier is on coal stage pilot duties, shunting mineral wagons around. Brighton Works was famous for having built all the bullied Pacifics view on its way to Ventnor. There have been proposals to reopen this stretch of line, but to no avail. 